process surrounding the operation and maintenance contract for the OB Curtis water plant is expected to be complete in November. Yes, 12 News Richard Lake has all the updates from Jackson's Mayor Chokwe and Tyler Mumba's media briefing this afternoon. Richard. That's right, Jeremy. Mayor Mumba told us what's new as the city works with local, state, and federal partners to come up with a permanent solution to Jackson's fragile water system. Now, according to Marilyn Mumba, vendors have already begun touring the water plant as the November 7th application deadline is now just eight days away. With the contract needing approval from the Jackson City Council, Marilyn Mumba says the voting body has been kept in, all, in the loop on all updates. The council has been updated consistently by our um, city attorney's office, uh, so they know what stage everything is in. Uh, they're not being kept in the blind uh, with respect to what's going on. If and when we land on a contractor, uh, it will be presented before the council uh, and the expectation would be their vote on it, uh, up or down. And so we feel that it is um, beneficial to make sure that they know where we are in the process. November 17th is still the target date for a maintenance and operating contract to be put in place. But if a contract is delayed or not agreed upon by then, a temporary contract would be pursued. And we'll have more from Mayor Lumumba and if the city of Jackson is in compliance with the Safe Drinking Water Act at 5 and 6. Jeremy.